Have you ever wondered what made the loudest sound on Earth? To put things in perspective, let's start small. Breathing is around 10 decibels. Light rain comes in at 40 decibels. You get 70 from a vacuum cleaner, 90 from a blender, and a live rock band will produce around 120. The decibel scale measures noise logarithmically. For our non-mathematicians, when a sound increases from 10 decibels to 20 decibels, it becomes 10 times more powerful. Going from 20 decibels to 30 increases the power by 10 times again. Once you get into the 150 decibel range, the sound becomes powerful enough to rupture eardrums. So you should stand well clear of a starting pistol at 140 decibels, or a rocket launch at 180. And at 194 decibels, sound waves become shock waves, which can destroy nearby buildings. But that's nothing compared to what happened on the 27th of August, 1883. On the Indonesian island of Krakatoa, a volcanic eruption produced what scientists believe to be the loudest sound recorded in human history, at an estimated 310 decibels. It was reportedly heard in more than 50 different locations, and the sound wave travelled three and a half times around the planet. For as many as five days after the explosion, weather stations observed an unprecedented spike in pressure, recurring roughly every 34 hours as it circled the globe. It caused deadly tsunamis as far as Hawaii and South America, major drops in temperature in the Northern Hemisphere, and deeply tinted sunsets in the West. Some scientists have theorized that Edvard Munch's The Scream depicts those vibrant orange skies. Nothing in recorded history has ever come close.